Breaking overnight new security video, it shows the moments before a JSO officer shot a man in Mandarin. It was captured at a store where it all unfolded. Good morning. So this happened after a high-speed chase where the speed reached 92 miles an hour. JSO says officers tried to pull the man over for running a red light. They say then the driver took off, the chase escalated, and as Bruce mentioned, got into those over 90 mile per hour speeds. Investigators say the driver finally stopped on San Jose Boulevard and started running. Now this part of the clip you see shows officers pulling up to the scene, and at one point during the chase, the driver was shot in the leg by that officer and is expected to be fine. So that's where News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding joins us live this morning. Ashley, you just got your hands on this video that you're going to share with us. Melanie and Bruce, good morning to you both. Yes, we got that video in the last 30 to 45 minutes. This was sent to me by a source. We were sent two separate videos. I want to go ahead and show these to our viewers once again. The first video, you can see the heavy police presence. This is where they stopped that, got that car to stop via stop sticks. Now, we have spotlighted this shot to give you guys a better sense of what you're looking at. It's right here in this area. You do see that suspect running, and you can see that chase on foot unfolding from there. Now, I said, as I mentioned, this is actually one of two videos that I was sent. I want to show you the second video. This is a bit more clear. It is from a different angle, but it does show what appears to be one of those officers running toward the camera, and you can see it does appear to be a person, an officer of the law. Now, eventually, that suspect was shot by an officer, shot in the leg, and that man was then transported to the hospital, where we're told he is now in a stable condition. But again, this all started started as a chase actually in the area of University Boulevard and Powers Avenue. They said that that driver uh, initiated a high speed chase and from there they tried to get that car to stop. Now they also tell us that there were actually six other people inside that car and they are now speaking with those people. Those, that's what the detectives are doing at this point. The investigation is still early on at this point of course and we will keep you updated with new details that do come in. I do want to go ahead and just show you right here if we could just to show you it is still an active scene the sun is up more clearly now and you can see police are still here they are wrapped around this building right here this welcome food store is right here at the intersection of san jose boulevard and addy lane of course as i mentioned we're gathering more information we will keep you guys updated reporting live ashley harding channel 4 the local station